the church that Jesus Christ is coming for is the glorified church. Is a church that is perfect in all things, a church that is this expression of his beauty, a church that he has cleansed to his word. You know, some people say that how will God cleanse us? Will he cleanse us by sickness? Will he cleanse us by sufferings? Will he cleanse us by poverty? No, no, at times, sometimes, times, no. God is going to cleanse us to his word. Like as you're listening right now, a cleansing is taking place. Hallelujah. So, the church of God, again, that we're going to see in these last days, is described as the church that is upon the mountain top. It is the church, not the church that is on the valley, not the church that is looking for money, not the church that is crying, not the church that is poor, not the church that is in sin. No, a church that is on the mountain top. And we see that in Micah chapter 4, verse 1. It says, Now it shall come to pass in the latter days, we are in the latter days right now. That the mountain of the Lord's house shall be established on the top of the mountains. Hallelujah. It shall be established. The church, you will be established in righteousness. You will be established in holiness in the last days. And many nations shall come and say, come, let us go up to the mountain of the Lord. You see, we are inviting people. We are going out to do outreach and people are not hearing us. We are going to preach. He says, no, in this last days, we are not going to be going. They will be the one coming. Why? The church is on the mountain top. The church will be expression of Christ. Christ that can walk on water. Christ that can raise the dead. They will be seeing it all around the world. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And this is the church that I present to you. This is the city that I present to you. This is the church that you belong to. So celebrate and be yielded to him. Because faith comes by hearing and hearing by the word. Hallelujah. I pray for you in the name of Jesus. That the word of God will gain entrance into your mind. And that the joy of the Lord will be your strength. The joy that comes from the word will be your strength. If you've been weary concerning the church or about yourself, about your Christian work, I decree and declare that let life come. For God is love and is responsible as your husband, the husband of the church, to bring you to his place of glory and harm. Without blemish or no wrinkle. In the name of Jesus Christ. You are blessed in Jesus name. So I want to encourage you precious saints. You, can, you want to know more about the move of God for these last days. You can join us on our different platforms. On social media. On WhatsApp. On um, Telegram. 